What's up guys, Pumi here, and welcome back to God of War. And uh, by accident, I forgot to hit record, but uh, I did a little thing with this guy, and this is the brother of the other guy, you know? It's his brother, he fixed up my axe, did a little bit of upgrading to it, and now we are on our way to spread my wife's ashes upon the mountains. I saw bones. I can't tell. Are we getting closer to the mountain? Nope. We are. Oh, wait. There was something way down there I want to check out. Come on, boy. Back down. Well, after exploring for five minutes, I realized there was nothing over there, and it was a big waste of my time. Oh, never mind, boy. We don't gotta fight her. She left because she's a she's a bitch and a whore. Ooh! I let nothing stop me. You know who I am. I'm not Kratos, I'm Angry Puma. Nothing gets in my way. More so if it does, I just get it out of my way and then I move on with life. It's like, well, this is a problem. Alright, fix the problem, we can move on. Sorry, did you get caught in the gas? Oh, you're lucky I can't fight you. Come on, you stupid bitch! Come on! I'm done! I'm tired! I don't wanna do this! Shut up! Nobody ever loved you, and no one ever will! Sorry, I get my, my, my anger. Well, that did nothing. Huh. Hmm. We'll need something to get through this one. Well, looks like we ain't getting through there. I like that though, that's pretty cool. Hey, watch this. Boy! Bro, he just walked it up like it was nothing! That stuff don't affect him. Do you think for this last leg up the mountain that maybe I can carry her? I told you no. Why? She meant more to me than you anyway. What? I, I just meant I spent more time with her. You were off hunting a lot. It would serve you to stop talking. <laughs> Chris is about to kick some ass. Get away from me! Don't touch me! Don't touch me! Oh, that wolf touched me. It looked like it had AIDS. I didn't need to blow any of those up, but I just felt like it. Oh, it's a good thing I did! Some goodies. What 
the hell is this? Hmm. How am I supposed to get to that though? I don't know how to get to that. Damn, that sucks. I don't even know how to do half the things in this game, and I'm just running by them. Oh! What's up, big bitch? Damn, bro. Okay, I see it. It's time to run. Ow, my arm! Yeah, stab him in the eyes. Good boy. Killed that monkey. That was a monkey, right? What the hell was that thing? I assume it was a monkey. Was that a monkey? That had to be a monkey. Sup, you stupid bitches. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. Didn't kill it. No, that definitely is a monkey. Ready yourself. That's a monkey. Ah! Oh! Okay, well, looks like we're gonna die. I can't dodge, I can't do diddly shit. I got an idea. Oh my god, I hate that once they hit me, I can't move. Stop healing, you cheating bastards! I'm so gonna die. Why did I run that way? Why did I run that way? Why am I... Why am I allowed to play as Kratos? Thanks for doing my job. Oh my god, I do nothing! Boy! I actually can't do damage to this thing. I can't damage it! <laughs> I like that. Up you go! Boy, are you doing damage to it? I'm not damaging it. Come here, you stupid bitch! I did nothing to it. I did nothing to it. <gasps> its face is its weak spot! Of course it is. Am I damaging it? I have no idea. Yes, yes, I was damaging it this whole time. Die, you stupid bastard.
die. Oh my god. <sighs> oh, that's why I said attack. Okay. No more. Ooh, symbol of truth. Ooh, I'm mentally ill. Whoa. I can see why mom wanted us to bring her here. Indeed. I love how it's like, indeed, ba-doom, 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 I'm gonna die. Hey, elevator. Wonder if Sindri knows his sky mover is tangled with boots up here. I doubt it. So how's he gonna get it to work? I do not care. Well, come on, Kratos, you gotta... You got it, that's the quickest way down for us. Damn, okay, I guess we ain't ever gonna know. That's the mountain we gotta climb? Oh man. Oh man. I don't wanna climb that Is thing. That smoke? It's fine, just gotta traverse the fog, Dark Souls style. Stay back don't touch back. it. Don't what? touch it. What is that? We must find another way up. The witch! Wish she was here. Bet she could get us past this. My magic is useless against the Black Breath, and there's no way around it. Odin saw to that long ago. What are you doing here? Making sure you can finish your journey. Why well, won't you us? I was busy saving my friend, if you remember. Good point. The Black Breath is a corruption of magic even I can't dispel. Only the pure light of Alfheim is strong enough to break through. But that road is long. What does this goal mean to you? Everything. It's everything. <laughs> I was right. Follow me. Why help us? Yes, why exactly? Maybe I see more of myself in you than I'm willing to admit. Maybe. Maybe. Just maybe. Maybe you will make up for a lifetime of mistakes. <sighs> or maybe I just like you. Probably just that last one. Even though you shot my friend, yes. Where must we go? To a realm beyond your own. Hey, we don't get to do it. Only for a little while. Only for a little while. <laughs> Follow the witch. The witch knows best. We'll use this. Greythaw. Can't. Sindri said it was broken. Sindri? The dwarf at the foot of these hills. He was fixing it when we got here. Well, no one was there when I passed by. Perhaps he finished. Dwarves are awfully resourceful. And irritating, based <laughs> on the two we have met. <laughs> that too. Just give that a turn. There. I'm gonna jump off. Nope, I can't. Tyr's temple is at the center of the lake. It is from there we travel to Alfheim. Thankfully, it's no longer underwater. Why is that creature in the bay? No one knows. He just appeared one day. Soon after, Thor attacked, and their battle could be felt across all the realms. Ultimately, it ended in a stalemate, and Thor returned to Odin empty-handed. The serpent stayed and grew so large, he now spans all of Midgard. See? Told you. They've hated each other ever since. Destined to kill each other, come Ragnarok. You believe in Ragnarok? I dearly wish I didn't, child. Ragnarok?
You know, we actually talked to the world serpent. You did? An exaggeration. I'm good with languages, even ones I've never heard before. But when he talks, I can't understand any of it. Sadly, no one can. He speaks a dead tongue. Oh. Must be lonely. Meh. <laughs> oh, we must traverse back. Okay, fine. What's in here? Wait, this is the way we came. Watch your step. Just along here. Are you sure? We came through here before and there's no way back to God. See? Is that so? Let me show you something. Are you watching? Riosta! What? It's solid! Elven architecture. My bowstring was soaked in the light of Alfheim. Huh. It can now reawaken the magic of the elves. Wait, it won't just disappear, will it? Not as long as the light shines free. This way. I want one. Those roots. What kind of magic is that? It's Vanir. From Vanaheim? You know of it? Just stories. Mother didn't say much about the Vanir gods. I don't have very just much like to say at this moment. As compared to Odin and Thor, they're the good guy. There are no good gods, boy. But I taught you that. I know. I killed them. From the giants, Great Tear used it to travel the nine realms and keep the peace between them. Doesn't seem very cool. Everywhere we I want to toss attack. this axe and hit that Especially thing. Especially by dead things. The risen yeah. dead grow ever more numerous. Once the if I just throw it high enough. People, now all have hid or fled, save for the reavers, savage enough to survive in such a world. If I can throw this far enough, I could hit that, I bet. I want to hit that. Bottom of these stairs. Hold on, I want to hit that thing. I know I can. I can't hit it. I want to hit it. That's my goal at the end of this of this is to hit that thing at least once. Hey, another one of those light crystals. Wait there while I reawaken the light. Leosta. That did it. Wow. Exactly. Mending the disrepair. Start by lifting that axle. Oh. Good. Now push it back into place. <laughs> Bridge along the track. <laughs> what? The whole entire bridge is turning. How is the whole entire bridge turning? Boy, you're really strong. Thank you. Keep pushing until the bridge reaches its first position. Tired yet? No. He's always been really strong. So about the dead. We heard someone call them hellwalkers. But what are they? They are poor, restless souls, denied their judgment and their peace. By what? Did Vanir magic raise the dead? It could, once. But this is no spell. This plague of dead is but a symptom of a world out of balance. Something or someone has meddled with powerful forces. That is all I know for sure. Oh, hey, hit it for smart. That's perfect. Come back up. We're ready now. That was impressive. Thank you. you I know. I've been working out. I did not hurt my back. <laughs> oh, old old age. <laughs> so did the giants or the elves build tier stuff? All the races helped with its construction. It was the last great act of cooperation between the realms before peace disappeared for good. Hey, buddy, you still in here?
What's up, bud? D, where'd he go? The door's still here, but he's not here. Leosa. Your bowstring stopped glowing. Its power is now depleted. Only a few knocks of magic remained in the bowstring, and we used them. Your bow, please. Once you claim the light of Alfheim, infuse the bowstring with its power. Don't forget. Hmm. Interesting. You talk like you're not coming with us. I'll try, but measures were taken to keep me trapped in Midgard. Why? The gods don't care for me much. I can see that. Is this it? It's so dark. This temple has been asleep, underwater for almost 150 winters. It needs only the light of the Bifrost to reawaken. Hmm. Do you have a natural flashlight? What? Those roots don't look like your magic. They aren't. These roots are part of the Great World Tree and make travel between the realms possible. Oh, like the stone I was given. Approach the table. How does it work? You will need this, a Bifrost, to create travel between realms. It can capture, hold, and transfer the light of Alfheim. Place the Bifrost there. What now? Give it a moment. The temple needs time to <laughs> Look at the boy in the back, he's bouncing up and down trying it to see. It is from this room, and this room alone, that you will be able to cross between realms. What you see before you represents the temple in which we stand. As well as the realm towers that encircle the Lake of Nine outside. All the realms exist in the same physical space, reflections of each other. These doors, the towers outside, and the Nine Realms are all intertwined and coexisting on the branches of the World Tree, separated only by the Bifrost Light of Alfheim. This place can focus and control that light. And is this the World Tree? Only an artistic representation of it. No, the Yggdrasil is much, much more than this. The tree of life is bound to the fate of the world, just as we are bound to it. The tree nourishes our soils. The dew from its leaves feeds our valleys and rivers. The tree's very existence supports all of creation along its boughs. Its life energy interwoven into the tapestry of life. Birth. Growth, death, and rebirth. Every strand transcending time, transcending space. Everything comes back to the tree. So, that's how it works. But I'm guessing you were looking for a more practical answer. Yes. Very well. The bridge you pushed outside is currently positioned to lead to the realm of Vanaheim. Instead, turn the wheel to our actual destination, Alfheim. Every realm has a travel room that unlocks the bridge to that realm. I'm giving you the one for Alfheim. Now you can lock in your destination. Hmm. And quickly, how do I move it again? I don't know. Don't know how to move We're it. Alright, whatever. Remember Travel. to take the Bifrost. You don't want to lose that. Now the realm travel bridge will align. And the realm between realms will open. That's cool. I like that. I like that a lot. See that giant crystal? Each realm has a corresponding one that focuses and amplifies the power of the Bifrost, opening the bridge to that realm. That's why realm travel is only possible from this room. What about that one realm tower I'm seeing from the lake? The Jotunheim Tower disappeared from all realms over a hundred winters ago, when the giants vanished from Midgard. Where the tower went and how they moved it remain a mystery. Do you 
I am still here. I don't know. Follow me. The Bifrost is dark. This trip was its last use. There's no going back until it's replenished with the light of Alfheim. Huh. So we are trapped. Someone of your ability should have little trouble getting back to Midgard. The captured light of Alfheim, yes. The hell? We in a whole new area. Oh, don't tell me I gotta do this for like seven different realms. That's too many realms. Welcome to Alfheim, gentlemen. Think you can spot the light? I can barely see it. Something's wrong. See that column of light on the horizon? Mm -hmm. It's housed in the heart of a ring temple. Mm -hmm. We'll find what we need there. Mm-hmm. No, no, no. Damn it, not yet. What's happening? <sighs> to restore the Bifrost magic, you must step into the light. But be very careful not to get caught. Oh! Hmm. She's not dead. Is she? No, just cursed to one area. Come. Look at this place. Stay by me. Touch nothing. Uh, okay. Oh man. What is that? Well, uh, that looks like a good place to end it. I do hope you all enjoyed. And I do hope you all consider subscribing and leave a like if you think that woman is dead. And with that, I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.